welcome Aries. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is your um, business monthly reading. Um, this was recorded in the month of November. It is a timeless reading. So I want to say thank you to each and every person. Remember that um, the channel is open. So if you would like to see the extended of this reading, please use the blue button to join. I want to say to each and every person, thank you um, for the support in this year, um, for how far we have uh, reached with this channel. It's a small channel. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. If this is your first time, I'm hoping um, to see you again. Please remember to like and share um, this video so that other people can um, receive this information. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we have a really, really busy four weeks period. Whatever is happening and transpired, this four weeks period is really, really busy. And uh, we are first going to be looking. I see a lot of you, especially young people, are trying to balance out a situation um, some sort of an information, some sort of a situation that has transpired um, in, the, um, in the month before you're trying to balance it out. So I see you young people are trying to offer or show some sort of affection um, to whatever that was happening and transpiring. So um, some sort of a situation transpired um, the month before uh, um, you came into this four weeks period and there was some sort of an issue and situation that was transpiring. Now, you are advised to go and check out uh, the um, Abundance in Money Prosperity Reading because that is going to be giving you more information about uh, um, your money, okay? So whatever that was happening and transpiring, you got to go check out uh, um, the uh, Abundance in Money Prosperity Reading. So as we look at the cross, um, this is what we do. As we come in this month, we're looking at the cross. Now, the cross is very significant. It uh, um, aligned you with what is transpiring. So as we look, we see some sort of an offer. You ladies 50 years and older um, or you ladies on the old wanted some sort of a new offer to come in. However, this is happening and transpiring, whether it's his work or career, I see that you ladies had hope for some sort of a new offer um, to come in. So what is transpiring is that uh, um, this offer is as if uh, they're still thinking whether or not uh, um, to allow you to receive this offer. There is uh, some sort of a situation that has come up that they are um, investigating um, a situation over you ladies and it's as if uh, um, they're wondering now it could be just a certain group of people so it could be a situation that they're wondering you know are we going to go further with this person um, you know how is this person um, performance what is the this person performance how have this person been performing is there any changes so it could be that they're looking at the last year or the last couple of years for you ladies. Um, you know, have you been late? That sort of a situation uh, could be coming up. Now, there was some sort of a problem that you ladies had um, got yourself in. However, this is transpiring. I see you regret whatever had happened. Um, some of you ladies could have a uh, uh, said that you were going to be leaving or you were going to be changing or um, you had applied for another department. So this is things that could be coming up that is uh, going to be, um, um, uh, you know, bringing back some sort of an issue that you ladies need to um, look at for yourself before any in, um, energies changes is going to be transpiring. So we see the energy of the devil in reverse and uh, um, there was something that has transpired in the months before that is coming back and affecting you ladies in 
this time period and it could be uh, that some of you didn't get to hand in your work on time um it could be various things that was happening or transpiring there could have been some sort of a discussion um that now it is coming back for you men i see you men are hoping for some sort of a new start we can see especially businessmen here managers are hoping for some sort of a new start is this new start going to be coming in that is a whole lot that is on um that is plain you men could be um you know trying to figure out and trying to resolve a situation in order for a new start to come in so if you notice uh, on top uh, there is the energy of uh, new offers and a lot of you ladies uh, and the men are wondering if this new offer is going to be coming in for you guys uh, and how it is going to affect your life so this is a time um period of these four weeks is going to be um putting a lot of you in uncertainty what is your position some sort of uncertainty for your position is going to be coming up so i see a lot of you are trying to resolve some sort of an issue this is what mostly issues um especially you businessmen um and women is trying to resolve some sort of issues and is wondering um there is a whole lot of uncertainty around you um areas um for issues that has transpired before is coming back to haunt you now and there is a lot of uh, um problems that you need to resolve a lot of challenges that a lot of you are going to be having where you need to resolve these challenges so as we look at the star line going in we're going to be realizing that the challenges needs to resolve Sometimes it is good to take time off in order to see what are the obstacles because there are obstacles that is transpiring for you, Aries. There's no question about it. There's a lot of obstacles. So it's about the renewal of bringing in a new start. Um, the ego... A lot of you are trying to calm your ego. And I think that that is the best thing to do. Um, calming the ego um, is going to be much better for you guys. Because if you go on the way that you're going on, you will not resolve and achieve um, what it is that you're supposed to be achieving. So I see um, as you look in the first week, uh, there was some sort of an issue. Um, this issue, the ego, using the ego is not um, one of uh, the most important thing in this month. So whatever is transpiring and happening, the ego is not going to be helping you in this, in this four weeks. Okay, it's all about you finding a way to balance out uh, some sort of uh, issues that was transpiring. And uh, in the first week, you're going to be realizing that uh, the ego is not going to be opening up the doors that you need to open up. So it is better to step back and look at uh, what you have done in the past and uh, create some sort of a balance that you can move through. Um, going in the future okay the second week you ladies are waiting 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 on an offer waiting to receive some sort of a information whether or not you're going to be receiving an offer you could have applied for a job and uh, you could have applied for work permit and that sort of a thing and you're waiting 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 some of you could be waiting um, to get some work done but you're waiting from another department um, for this other department to um, give up um, 
um, what you're waiting on. So there is just multiple, multiple things uh, that is happening and is transpiring. The Ten of Cups is in reverse. So I see some of you ladies are not uh, happy with where you are. A lot of you ladies are thinking about moving forward or a lot of you ladies feels, feels as if uh, you were left out, left out in a situation, left out in the cold. And I see that some of you ladies are going to be reaching out uh, to friends to see if uh, friends have any um, good idea whether or not friends know of any uh, new opportunities, new doors that is going to be open up. Because I see a lot of you women are a little bit worried of uh, your position at this time. And we're talking about women 50 years and older. You're very much worried of uh, um, what is the position moving forward for you. So I see in the second week, it's going to be bringing a whole lot of worries for the women 50 years and older. And the women 50 years and older are going to be in an uncertainty position. And why is this? It depends on who you are and what have been transpiring around you. But I see that the men, the businessmen in the second week is also waiting on some form of information um, in order to give them a new start to move forward. In the third week, you're dealing with some uh, um, emotional situation about an offer that you were waiting on. Um, there is still no answer in the third week. A lot of you are really open to hear um, if, whether or not this offer is going to be coming in. So a lot of you are really standing and trying to figure out and trying to resolve a situation in order to find out if, uh, um, to give you some sort of a certainty because there is some certainty about your position at this moment. And it's affecting a whole lot of uh, you areas for whatever the reason is. Even though you have uh, removed the ego out of the situation, it is really affecting a lot of you areas. As we look at the um, fourth week, we see the energy of the Six of Cups. Now, the Six of Cups is that some of you Aries are really showing more emotions at the work floor. Um, if you were someone who had ego, I see you're letting go of the ego and showing your team um, team players, team workers, uh, um, your team more emotion. Um, is it that it's Christmas? Is it that it's the end of the year? What is the reason? But I see that is going to be good moving forward because through showing more emotions towards your colleague or towards people, I see that um, some sort of a shift of energy is coming in. So if you were a rigid manager, I see you are um, removing the ego and is really standing and looking at the lay of the land of what has happened and what has transpired. I see a lot of you are turning away from the ego-based energies that you're always using and you're trying to figure out a better way in order to move forward. And I see that this is going to be good. So as we look at the top, a lot of you are waiting for some sort of an offer some sort of a news, some sort of an offer to come in. This is what we see. A lot of you are also waiting on, uh, it could be news um, saying whether or not uh, um, this company, your position um, is going to be moving forward. And I see that this is a, a situation where a lot of you are now opening up uh, in order to resolve some sort of a problem and uh, to resolve the issues that was going on and create a, some sort of a better stability between you and your team or you and other people in the organization. So it is um, a four weeks period where a lot of you Aries is going to be really um, thinking about what direction you're going in and how you're going to be choosing to do the right thing to move in um the right direction for a lot of you it's going to be a situation where you need to find out what it is that you truly want what it is that is working for you and this is what is going to be coming up 
So um, if you'd like to see um, the extended of this reading, you can use the blue button. The blue button will help you to join the channel. And there you can see multiple readings that is already there. Um, you can see the extended of months before. And because this channel is um, a, um, uh, um, a channel that is built with the frequency of um, timeless, timeless reading, it will advise you as to what is coming up the next year. So it is some people energies and some people frequency or late. And this is going to be bringing back a lot of people frequency and energies. Okay. So you can look at what is going on and then figure it out and you can get all the extended from the abundancy money reading. I got to go. Namaste until next time.